Sorry, my phone's ringing. Let me turn the phone off. Maybe that'll be an easy way to conduct an interview. Kind of having seen wild child events before and it being something that we believe in. Um, well, it's you know just I mean the, the history of war Childs, You know, for, I mean I was first aware of it when Radiohead got involved um, years ago, and it just um, and just you know brought that to my attention. So uh, you know things, uh, what they're doing in various countries. Uh, you know the things that they're doing at, at the minute in Iraq. That um, I think it was something like one child dies every five minutes or something ridiculous, which is pretty disgusting. Uh, my first memory of making music was around about seven years old when I uh, got a load of Tupperware tins and uh, spread them out in front of me with a Casio keyboard and uh, a tape recorder, a little square, what, not square, what, oblong, yeah, yeah I've said it, I, I dare to say the word oblong, you can use it, and, you can um, use it. Um, and yeah, just uh, recording it and... Uh, and that's pretty much the uh, basis the of drums music. that we used for the first EP. Uh, just you know, we tried with so many kits and so many live kits and so many electronic kits. And you, can't just, you can't, you can't you replicate can't that, that sound. And uh, Dave's head, that works as a drum. For the type of music we make, the first time that I was in, enlightened onto it um, was uh, seeing uh, probably quite a cliche, but saw Daft Punk uh, play in the uh, dance tent at Glastonbury. So cliche. <laughs> Call it a cliche. Then. Uh, and when it must have been what was it ninety seven or maybe it was a year no, just just like yes yeah, so it was like ten years ago it was the last time that they toured and it was kind of like I was I was pretty young and it was the first time I kind of understood electronic music and kind of seeing what it could do you, you were I was what you were PYT pretty young <laughs> <laughs> yeah thanks for disrupting my my, my emotional story about I think, yeah. bonding with electronic music RYT round young thing. <laughs> The only kind of music that we can't stand. I mean, UB40. Yeah. Um, things like that. Yeah. Wege. In fact, reggae. Not really much of a fan. No. As Morrissey said. Reggae is vile. Apparently. When, uh, the moment that I realised that I wanted to do and I could do music was when my hands, well, they were hooves at the time and they evolved <laughs> into hands and it was just. And yeah. I thought, what can I do with these? And then you got given a, a medieval loot for your birthday and figured that... The loot? Oh, yeah. Is that what it's called? Yes. yes. And that's just how we learned music. I just kicked it. <laughs> made it sound. It's a nice percussive sound, the loot. But I kick most things. Uh, a yeah. personal song. Um, probably uh, A Thousand Things. Um, it's a point in my life which was rather traumatic. And uh, yeah, and at last show as well. Um, that's quite a kind of hope. Um, it's all quite emotive. That's yeah. Point. I mean, I don't think this. I mean, we've never made a track that hasn't, uh, or a song that hasn't, um, you know, had some sort of um, emotional feeling behind it. You know, it's it's all about you know trying to prove that electronic music isn't just about making people dance, and it can do a little bit more. Because in the space of a song, it can just express every feeling uh, you've ever had and to feel, um, I don't know, just a, such emotion. Um, it can express kind of emotions inside you that you could maybe never articulate. No, I think when we, when we uh, write songs we tend to sit down and write the songs for what they are and we don't really particularly pay too much attention to kind of what you the, should be doing. Yeah, or the fact that this is the instrumentation that we want to do to make this sound or to, you know, or to fit into this particular scene. We just kind of make music that, you know, the, the instruments, to us, yeah, really. the instruments that we use are just, that they're just, you know, they're just like kind of the, these things that we can use to express things. It's not specifically yet we use electronic instruments because we, you know, that's just what, how, how we choose to express our ideas. Do your bit for Warchild. Organise a gig to raise awareness for Warchild.